Hey guys, welcome back to Game Fortress. My name is Sky, and I have a brand new video for you today. And for the longest time, I feel like I've been silent on YouTube. You know, I just had to take a personal hiatus, you know. But, you know, I'm finally back, and I have made a gun that has a special place in my heart. Probably one of my most favorite SMGs in the world, and it was just so much fun building this gun and it was just an awesome experience you know so anyway guys please enjoy my lego mp7 so the mp7 is a submachine gun made by heckler and cloak and it's designed to be very low profile so it can basically turn it into a machine pistol to an assault rifle and it features a foldable grip that uses these hinge plates that lock it in place and it's actually quite sturdy and it doesn't usually move around when it's locked into place and you could just detach it from the hinge plates to fold it back in and then here you have the retractable stock and it works on a pin system you know old-fashioned pin and it's not the longest but it's good for shoulder comfort and then here is basically what it's like as a machine pistol and here's the flip up sights turning it into basically more of an SMG and these are what the sights look like and then the sights when they're down it's not a rifle sight anymore but more as a pistol sight for a low profile and here's the magazine. As you can see, it goes four studs wide to three studs wide. And that's just so I can get the angle of the thumb grip in there. And it works quite nice. Uh, it doesn't fall out. It, friction alone keeps it in there. And the charging handle, it goes back six studs and it retracts on a rubber band system. So that's pretty neato. And so this is the transformation, and now I will show you the attachments. So here is the re reflex sight. This is what I use in-game. And I use a sight because it's very low profile, stuff I always like. And it also has superb target acquisition with that triangle uh, sight. And it's just such a great design. And of course this design was completely copied by Brickbill and... Um, and Nick Brick, thank you uh, for your great design. Honestly, it's very accurate, and it's just so good for what it is. Also, another design by them too is um, it can actually detach from the quote-unquote rail. So if you want to like attach it on a pistol, you could do that. And then our next attachment is the suppressor. This is also what I use in game because. Uh, Bandit does not have access to an ACOG, so I can definitely risk the recoil. And something funny about this attachment is that you don't attach it onto a barrel. In fact, you completely swap out your barrel. And that's just, it's so much easier and it's more flexible. Um, so there's the sideways plate. So if you wanted to attach a suppressor, you would have to completely swap out your barrel. So anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed my MP7. I worked very hard for this and... It's just such a good gun. So if you have liked this video, please drop a like down below and I'll see you all next time.